Well, a well-known Salt Lake City landmark could be facing a wrecking ball soon. ABC4's Nick McGurk reached out to the city council to find out the future of the Utah Theater. And to have one of the best theaters in the United States right here in Salt Lake, that means something. Standing outside the old Utah Theater, you wouldn't necessarily know it, but this place was special. We've had Alvin Costello, uh, Shirley Temple, Al Jolson, Will Rogers, they are performed here. And one of the great performers, Babe Ruth. Our Craig Worth, a reporter and local historian, says this theater, built more than a century ago, was a statement. It was built for a cost of $2 million in 1918. That's about a zillion dollars today. And money, lots of it, would be required to save it now. And I'm coming here today to beg you to consider preserving that theater. At a meeting late last month, the RDA took public comment on the theater. The RDA acquired the property in 2010. The redevelopment agency of Salt Lake City bought the property back in 2010 and had analyzed in years since how to make it work. There is a lot of interest in the building. There is a lot of sentiment to save the building. But with time, the RDA came to the conclusion it would cost too much money to the tune of between 50 and 80 million bucks. There is no more demand for these type of venues. And I think that's the reason why you didn't see uh, the theater, the Pioneer Theater, saved. And I think it's where we're at right now with Utah Theater. That's my candid answer. There's money out there from outside the state that could come in and get this going. Nick McGurk, ABC4 News. The RDA telling us by email that they are still working to identify a purchase price for the property. The developers plan to put a high-rise mixed-use tower in the theater's place.